Let's go back uh, a bunch of years to the beginning. You mentioned you went to school with super intensive education. So I thought it'd be really interesting to look at some of the powerful aspects of that education, from the languages to the math. Can you actually describe some of the rigorous aspects of it and what you gained from it? At the age of 11, I got the opportunity to enter an experimental school in St. Petersburg, where I lived, and you had to pass a rigorous test to get accepted. The idea behind the school was that if you try to squeeze as much information as possible into a brain of a teenager, making a focus on math and foreign languages, then there will be some changes in the brain of the student that will allow the student to understand most other disciplines. But we had a class as a result that didn't have any single focus. It was very widespread across a lot of disciplines. You would have four foreign languages at least, including Latin, English, French, German. You would have classes like biochemistry or psychoanalysis, evolutionary psychology. The difference of this class as opposed to other classes in the same school, which was part of the St. Petersburg State University, and called academic gymnasium, was that unlike other classes which were specialized in some single subject like physics or maths or history, this one tried to get the best from all of these specialized classes and bring it into one curriculum. Since it was an experimental class, it wasn't possible to become a straight A student, to be excellent in all the subjects. It was like considered crazy to even try. So it's assumed nobody's able to handle it. You're just pushing the limits of the human mind. Four languages in parallel, math, evolutionary psychology, just overwhelming the mind to see what happens. In any case, I learned a lot from that experience. 